this is a story all about how my life got flipped, turned upside down, and I'd like to take a minute and just sit right there and tell you how I became the prince of a town called Bel Air. In West Philadelphia, born and raised on a playground is where I spent most of my days. Chilling out, Max, and relaxing all cool, and I'll shoot some b ball outside the school when a couple of guys who were up no good started making trouble in my neighborhood. I got one little fight. My mom got scared. She said, You moved with your auntie and uncle in Milan. I begged, then I pleaded with her day after day, but she packed my suitcase and sent me on my way. She gave me a kiss, and then she gave me my ticket. I put my Walkman on. I said, I might as well kick it. First class, yo, this is bad. Drinking orange juice out of a champagne glass. Is this what the people of Bel Air live like? Hmm, this might be all right. Wait, they hear the prissy, bourgeois, and all that. Is that the kind of place to send this cool cat? I don't think so. I'll see when I get there. I'll be prepared for the Prince of Air. Well, the plane landed, and when I got out, there's a dude just like a cop standing there with my name out. I don't want to get arrested yet. I just got here. I sprang with the quickness like light and disappeared. I whistled for a cab, and when it came near, the license plates had fresh their dice in the mirror. If anything, I knew that this cab was there, but now nah, forget it. Yo, home to Bel Air. <laughs> I pulled up to the house about seven or eight and I called to the cab. Yo, I'll see you later. Look at my kingdom. I was finally there to sit on my throne as the Prince of Bel Air.